Welcome. So I'm going to show you step by step how you can acquire links from very powerful .org domains. So domains that are from organizations with a DR from around 40 upwards to around 90 for free. So here's how you do it. Let's say, for example, let's choose a niche. Let's say my niche is, for example, a pet grooming and I'm, a, I mean, I'm in Dallas. So I'm, a, I'm a pet grooming company. Again, this works for any business anywhere. Just for example sakes, I need to use this. Okay. So again, this is me. Let's assume, for example, this right here uh, is my site. Okay. Let me just paste this. I don't know who these guys are. Let's assume again, this is our site. Let me just paste it here into uh, Ahrefs to see. Okay. We have at the moment um, 3.1 backlinks, 3.1K backlinks from 400 domains and our DR is 50. And we want to get more backlinks because the competition has a higher DR and has even more powerful backlinks than us. And so how do we build the perfect backlink? So by now you know that the perfect backlink is one that has very high metrics, that's an M, right? And also very high levels of relevancy, right? So this is the two things you want when you're building links. Metrics, of course, high DR, high UR, uh, high traffic, right? And relevancy, of course, is if our site is about dog grooming, right? We want links to be pointing out to our sites that are related with dog grooming, right? We don't necessarily want a link from a, a, a store that sells a, or a, a car mechanic, right? Linking, us, linking to us, even though it might be from a powerful domain with traffic, it's a very irrelevant link. So the perfect link again is one that's with high metrics, high DR, high UR, high traffic, right? And as well as relevant. And the best links that satisfy these criteria are these from non-profit organizations. So what you do, just go to non-profits, let's say Dallas, for example. Again, I just oh, click this, open this. This is like a directory of non-profit uh, organizations in Dallas, okay? I just opened up a couple, right? There's this one, for example, Greyhound, whatever, right? There's uh, this one for breast cancer. There's this one for not too sure, right? There's a bunch of them, right? I, I just pasted some here, okay? Now, if we take this, for example, the Greyhound, whatever, because it's in our niche, just open up their site right here, right? Uh, da, 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 da. It's this one right here. They changed the domain, so this is the the site. Okay, so again, org domain, right? Hyper relevant because this is, uh, um, if I'm not mistaken, right? It's a adoption or a non governmental organization, non profit organization, right? So in the dog niche, right? We paste it right here. So dr forty, which is decent, right? Domain with real traffic, okay, right? On our dot org, which is a um, a powerful trustworthy TDL, okay. What we do. And all these sites have this, okay? You go to their uh, sponsors page because every single one of these uh, nonprofits has a sponsor page, right? And you see here on these sponsor pages, th these are all links to uh, businesses in the area. For example, this is linked to, let's see, this is linked to uh, uh, another foundation, right? This is linked to, let me see here, some of these are links to foundations, of course. Uh, this is linked to a, to a business, right? To a, a private business that sells dog foods, okay? And so what you do, quite simply, and the way you show up here in these sponsor pages is just you reach out to them and you make a donation, right? And in, in, um, in return, right, they allow you to be placed on here, on this sponsor page, right? So again, yeah, you are paying for the link, you're giving a donation, which goes to a great cause, and you're getting a backlink. So this is, this is the best type of backlink you can have, again, Super powerful domain, super relevant, and there's a ton of these, right? There's there's a ton. I just searched nonprofit Dallas, and there's there's infinite, infinite, right? There's 12 pages, right? It's insane, right? You can just go through these, open these up, right? Again, open the URL, see how powerful. Uh, okay, this is this is gone, but again, open and see how powerful the, the, they are. For example, this right here, right? Dr. 60. Like, surely they have a page for, let's see, let's see, donate, right? They have a page for donation, so you can donate, donate, of course, and surely they have a page for their their sponsors somewhere around here. Oh yeah, there you go. Impact and go to partners. Go to partners. There you go. All their partners right here. And again, all this links to the business. So I go here and click this this coffee, for example. Again, a link to this coffee brand, a private business, right? There you go. What they did is just, they just most likely donated to this cause, which again is great. You're donating to a good cause and getting a backlink in return from the uh, sponsors uh, section. Super easy to do, right? Super easy to do. Again, for a good cause and you get a great backlink. Short one today, but this is super valuable, right? It's insanely valuable and it's super easy to do. And it's a strategy that not a lot of people talk about because I don't know why, not a lot of people know about it, but it's insanely powerful. And this allows you to get backlinks that most of your competitors will not have guaranteed. So you get exclusive backlinks that your competition doesn't have, plus high metrics, so high traffic, high DR, high UR, right? And hyper, hyper, hyper relevant, hyper niche down, okay? So that's it. Guys, if you want more training and more... Um, 
stuff like this, more insights into the SEO space, you can just go to tryjournalist.com forward slash academy. It'll be the first link in the description. And you can get my course, right? You can get my course and you can just scroll past all these results from people who use the course and use the training there and use the software, right? Um, you get access to my software for 12 months. So you get access to Journalist AI, the AI software that I use, not just an AI writer, but an AI holistic AI software for 12 months for a full year, which does all this stuff. You get access to the community, weekly live SEO calls, a one-on-one -on -one consulting call with myself, right? I guess just go over your current SEO strategy and think about how, how I can help you, what we can do to improve, right? You get access to my seven SEO courses plus an exclusive plugin. So you get access to my AI SEO course, SEO for beginners, local SEO course, uh, how I rank videos on YouTube and Google. So video SEO course, link building course, right? They choose how to build links that are worth around $300 each because I sell these exact links that I teach you how to build on this course for around $300 a pop. My rank and rent SEO course plus the plugin, my e-commerce SEO course, and a bunch of detailed step-by-step -step case studies. I mean, there's, it's all boiled down what you get right here in the page. But uh, in all essence, you get lifetime access to all my courses, right? Plus a full year's access to this software, which is, is insane, right? Again, if you're just building backlinks as your SEO strategy, that won't work. You need to build out content. You need to build out a proper holistic SEO strategy, which this tool does, right? There's even this new feature we released, which is called the AI agent, where you just add in your site and it will automatically fix your stuff, fix your page titles, your meta titles, fix your um, your link, internal linking structure, your image alt text. It's insane. I can even show you, right? I just go here to my dashboard, right, real quick. Because I think, I mean, if you're already here, uh, why not? Go to blog automation, go to site optimizers. You just click create optimizer, put your name, Add your site URL, select the language because we do this for any, any language. Select how many pages you want to analyze, click create. Let me just show you an example of, of my own site. Click journal and say, I write. And as you can see here, this AI agent, right, analyzed 20 pages, right? And for all these pages, it analyzed all this stuff. So the page titles, the meta descriptions, meta keywords, canonical URLs, image alt text, internal links. And for example, for page titles, it says, okay, listen, right? Your page title for this page right here, for the forward slash ghost page, which is just basically a, a page on our site that has. It talks about our, our integration with Ghost because we integrate with Ghost, we integrate with all these other uh, CMSs, right? Super simple page, okay? And it tells us, hey, listen, your meta title is this. Ghost AI is your writer, try for free, journalist AI, right? We think you should change it to this. And here's why. It gives you the why, right? The title is more concise, whatever. It just basically tells you, hey, listen, change from this to this, and here's why. If you click apply, it will be automatically changed on your site, right? And you can either choose apply or discard. And based on what you do, right, the AI will learn for future suggestions to make sure that it knows exactly what you're looking for as a human. So you can just go here and see apply all, and this will be automatically applied to your site. It's pretty cool. Same thing for descriptions, uh, image alt text. I can assure you that if you do this right now, you'll have a bunch of images with alt text because most people do. Uh, internal links is super valuable, right? Let's say, for example, you have a site, a big, big site with a bunch of pages, right? The AI will read through, the AI, excuse me, will read through the whole site and find which pages you should be linking out to. So it says, okay, this page should link to this one, this page should link to this one, this one should link to this, this one, excuse me. So basically we'll build out an automatically internal uh, linking structure on, on our palette for you. For example, it says the slash ghost page should link to this page using this anchor text and here's why, right? Again, you can just set up a proper internal linking structure just with a click of a button. So it's the AI agent that automatically does your technical SEO for you, right? Super cool. Then also if you wanna use it to generate articles, um, and, and blog posts, it also does it for you, right? For example, if I open this up right here, this is for a, a gardening niche. This was all done um, with AI, right? The featured image, right? The table of contents, proper content structure. There's internal links in the article. There's external links too. There's even in-article images, even in-article videos that are relevant to what the, the content is about. So all this done with AI, linking to our products, linking to our services pages, linking to Wikipedia. And if for some reason, right, you don't like the output, right? Because sometimes, People might not like the output of the AI, right? We've built this tool because Journalist AI is, is an a holistic tool, right? We help you not with just generation, we help with the editing as well. Let's say, for example, you think here it's missing some links. You go, just go add external links and the AI will automatically add external links to this uh, paragraph right here, taking into account the whole context of the article. So you can just select these, there you go. Now, of course, you can do all this manually, but why would you when you can choose, use AI to do it for you automatically? Uh, for example, let's say if you're using AI images, you can just say, mm, I don't like this too much, add a dog. And the AI will add a dog not just adding a dog, it will take into account the context of the existing image and add a dog to it. So in this case, it's like a garden, right? And there you go, dog in a garden. You can accept or discard this. If you say, for example, you think this is a bit too short, you can um, make it longer, make it longer, make it shorter, make, it, make a list, make a table. So if you just make it longer, the AI will make this a bit longer, add a bit more context to the article. Now again, all this is done just to save you time, right? For example, let's say you want to add a custom prompt. You wanna say, oh, write this, write this more tailored, tailored to, beginner gardeners and mention my uh, ebook 
that they can download for free, whatever. You can, again, you can custom prompt this, not just the paragraph, but you can custom prompt the whole article, which is pretty cool. And so again, the whole goal with this tool is to b create a holistic SEO tool for you. You can even syndicate it to social media. So all in all, what this does is you can connect Journalist AI with your website right here. And it also does the keyword research for you. So you can do keyword research for you, right? Based on that keyword research, you can generate the articles for you. Then you can set it to auto-publish, so you can make it so the AI publishes automatically to your site with the auto-blogging feature. So you can have it so it publishes every day, every single day for a week, like from Monday to Friday, right? Then on top of that, once all these articles are, of course, published to your site, and again, if we expand on one of these right here, we open up the article, all of them will have a featured image, a table of contents, proper content extraction with in-article images, in-article views, uh, external links, so linking out to Wikipedia, for example, maybe linking out, if this is an article about finance, linking out to Investopedia, right? It links out to places where it finds relevant to link out to. Also, internal links, these articles will be all interlinked between each other in a way that makes sense. Again, it just saves you so much more time, because you can do all this manually, but with AI, it just saves you some more time. Also, on top of that, it can index automatically the content on Google and syndicated social media. So you can take all these posts and automatically syndicate them to your LinkedIn, your Twitter, your Facebook on autopilot. And if you've watched this video right here, you know how important this is because uh, AI search engines like ChatGPT, Perplexity, Grok, right? They take into account not just the content on your site, but the content on social media. So if you want to rank or get recommended or be mentioned first on these AI-based or LLM-based search engines, this is key. And so all in all, Journalist AI basically automates the whole process for you, uh, which, uh, which is pretty cool. Th this is my favorite feature, by the way, Lead Magnets. I won't cover this right now, but it's, it's super cool. I don't know why not, not a lot of people use it, but uh, just, it's just insane. I'll leave a link down below in the description so you can see what it does, but it's, it's super cool. Uh, you can even add a knowledge base so, to make sure that you, you can basically upload info into the AI. You can upload YouTube videos, text documents, audio documents, um, anything you want, right? So you, you're basically feeding the AI with info, so then it knows how to write content based on your brand's tone of voice, your brand's mannerisms, so it doesn't write this um, um, AI slop or AI generic AI content, it's pretty cool. You can even add your own custom images if you'd like. I mean, there, there's just there's, there's a ton of stuff. It also generates blog articles, news articles, uh, Amazon product reviews, you can convert YouTube videos to blog posts. Uh, this is pretty cool, not a lot of people use this, but this basically allows you to generate articles on your industry. So let's say, for example, you have an article, or excuse me, a website about, uh, about dogs, okay? and you produce blog posts, you have all your sources, whatever, right? And then you have a, a news section, a dedicated news section where people, people, people click it and they go to a page with a bunch of news about whatever is new in the animal space. And it does this automatically, right? right? It's always automatically for you. So this will make sure that your site becomes hyper relevant in the space for, uh, for everything dog related, making sure that the Google and other search engines know you are the authority in the space for dogs. Now, I ran through this super quick. There's a bunch of courses here on YouTube for free where I explain this in a bit, in a bit more detail, so you can go watch them. I'll link them down below uh, on how to do, actually do SEO because this, by the way, isn't the magic tool, right? If you don't know what you're doing, this, this is pointless for you, right? So learn SEO first and then go actually use this tool. And uh, just to finish off, speaking of backlinks, if you don't want to have all the trouble that I just went over, you can just go here, purchase backlinks, and I can build backlinks for you, okay? I, I think I'll go over a bunch of results right here from previous clients we had. I can build backlinks that have a DR40 for you, a thousand plus months of search traffic, and there are niche type uh, backlinks. So that's it. That's a video, long ending, but hopefully you found this valuable. And if you want to give this a go, again, you get 12 months access to this for a full year, plus all of my SEO courses right here, right, included lifetime access, by the way. And uh, of course, 100% money back guarantee. So again, I'll leave this link. It's going to be the very first link in the description. Thanks so much for watching. Like, subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.